which expression is equivalent to one third times six x squared times y squared times two x to the third y to the fourth for all values of x and y where the expression is defined. So this problem is all about understanding the laws of exponents. Okay, so let me just go ahead and rewrite this so we can see this just a little bit better. So one third times six x squared times y all in parentheses squared times 2x to the third times y to the fourth. So we're going to do this in segments. So the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to focus on this section right here that's all getting squared inside of parentheses. So I'm going to bring my one third down and I'm going to start working on this section. So first of all, 6 squared or 6 times 6 is 36. All right, next we have x squared raised to the power of 2. So x squared squared, if we know our laws of exponents, we know that whenever one exponent is raised to another exponent, we actually multiply those two numbers. So 2 times 2 is 4, so we're going to write x to the fourth power. And then we have y squared, and that's just going to be y squared, right? y to the second power. So let's go ahead and fill in the rest. So 2x to the third, y to the fourth. All right. And then again, now I'm going to focus on these two sets of parentheses and get them sorted out. So I'm going to bring down my one third. All right. First, I'm going to do 36 times 2, which is 72. Then I'm going to do x to the fourth times x to the third. So again, laws of exponents. Whenever we multiply uh, two variables that have exponents, we actually add the exponents. So 4 plus 3 is 7, so I'm going to put x to the seventh. And then we have y squared times y to the fourth. So again, we're going to add these exponents. So 2 plus 4 is 6. So I'm going to have y to the 6th power, okay? And then the only other thing I have to do in this problem is take 1 third and multiply by 72. So 1 third of 72 is 24. Bring the rest of my answer down. And so I'm going to get 24x to the 7th, y to the 6th. And we should see that